First at five, breaking news. A massive earthquake has hit between Cuba and Jamaica. The powerful 7.7 .7 quake struck south of Cuba and northwest of Lucy, Jamaica. This is video from the Cayman Islands showing rushing water from a nearby pool that looked like it was it had ocean waves. And there are reports that the earthquake was felt in downtown Miami, Kendall and Brickell, which prompted evacuations. CBS4 chief meteorologist Craig Setzer joining us now. So Craig, what do we need to know here in South Florida? Well, first off, we need to know that we are we're safe here in South Florida. We are not on any major fault lines. And so what we feel typically, if we feel anything at all, is from a distant earthquake, and this one about 400 miles away, and a very strong one at 7. Point seven, located about right there. So there's Cuba, Jamaica, located to the southeast and the Cayman Islands to the west. Now, in the last hour, there have been aftershocks. They have been farther to the west uh, near the Cayman Islands, and so those folks are uh, still starting to feel feeling some shaking, still feeling some shaking going on. In fact, our shake indications indicate as far away as Cancun, feeling uh, shaking from the earthquake, Marathon, and much of southeast Florida, as well as the Caymans, Jamaica. And while there are no reports plotted here. There were likely reports also of shaking in Cuba. So why did we have an earthquake down here? Well, this is along the Cayman Trough here, and it separates the North American plate from the Caribbean plate. And these two plates, they're slowly sliding in different directions, and pressure builds up along those plates. And occasionally, when that pressure breaks free, uh, you have an earthquake. Now, we don't get tsunamis with this area here because these plates are sliding, so uh, the, as opposed to the ground or the Earth's crust shooting up where the land is coming together, these pieces of land are just sliding along each other. The only time we do get a uh, type of tsunami from this would be from an underwater landslide. Now, the earthquakes, they're not that uncommon down in this area. Just two years ago, there was a magnitude 7.6 earthquake uh, to the west of the Cayman Islands there. And amazing how far away we felt it, 400 miles from the epicenter there. And we may even feel a little slight rumbling with these aftershocks, but nothing as big as today expected. All right, Craig, thank you very much.